Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and children of all ages. Right, in this segment again, I'm going to uh, be reviewing Kiss Cider Cherry Taste with Real Fruit, 4.5%. So it's going to blow me sideways a wee bit. But anyway, uh, it was only about, I think, like £1.30. It is like a version of like a corner shop that sells it absolutely everything like a uh, M and M and N uh, shop and aye uh, like one of like one of the shops that you always see on being like Liverpool no no Liverpool uh, London or Birmingham where it's got like a awning thing over the top of it and like uh, lots and lots of bric-a-brac stuff uh, outside it one of the type of shops. Aye, so, um, here goes. It's either got to be absolutely incredibly disgusting or amazing. Uh, right, here goes. Anyway, I just wish it was 330 mils instead of 500. God, it smells, it smells strong. I might not be able to withstand this. Here goes. Right, oh, wait, uh, don't know what country it's from. I'll have to do my research and get back to you on that. Should have done it before that. Right. No, it's all right. I think I've tried a cherry uh, cider before, but it's only been 3.4. But when it's 3.4, and then you go all the way up to 4.5, you can taste the difference. It's all right. It's refreshing, but it's not bad. It's good for the price. Includes apple wine, forty six percent water, apple juice from concentrated, forty eight percent glucose syrup, water, glucose for cutie something pear, cherry juice from concentrated six percent i didn't get that sometimes right uh you get like a cherry juice or apple juice or or i uh these they two kinds right and the main flavor is apple or a uh, cherry in this case but when you read it it's got like a uh, one or two other flavors it's like for instance the bad apple energy drink monster uh, aye, it's, the ingredients say that it's got, like, uh, sour cherry in it, and, and, uh, and kiwi. Or, if you get, like, um, another drink, and it says it has, like, a uh, carrot extract in it. Strange. Hmm. Don't know about this though, yeah. Doesn't it really properly ch taste the cherries? Wait. Hmm, I don't know about that. It's just average. Right, anyway, so as I was going to say there, right, that, um, oh, what was I going to say? Aye, that was it. Um, that bad, no, no bad apple, uh, the spiced apple Koppenberg or Koppenberg <clears throat> that I reviewed uh, recently, and uh, I told my two uncles about it, right, but the main reason... I'm saying this is because now that I've had time to mull it over and properly digest the flavour compounds of the the beverage in question, right, 
that it had like a, a small hint of uh, like a Coca-Cola and Pepsi like after taste. I think it's because uh, Pepsi has a cinnamon uh, sort of taste or vanilla uh, taste. But uh, it did have a, definitely did have a Coca-Cola and Pepsi uh, vibe to it. I would really recommend it. Uh, uh, I uh, undersell sell it and then when I finish it, it's better than what I thought. It's just, uh, I'll probably say that that's better than what I thought. It's just with that one being 4.5 instead of 3.4, when you swallow it, you can taste the alcohol. Still don't care about it yet. Can I make up my mind? It's just strange. It's just because I'm no used to anything stronger than 3.4. But recently, uh, I got a Magner's uh, Dark Fruit Cider and uh, Irish Bar uh, in Onskark, Lancashire, England. And that was incredible. But it, a pint's too much. I should have got a half a pint. Would have been cheaper as well. Four pound for a, a pint of cider and Omskirk. Anyhow, uh, I got my father a, uh, a Guinness. Well, a Guinness and uh, black currant. Tried a wee bit and it's absolutely incredibly disgusting. How anyone can uh, drink it is beyond me. Apparently it's nice and smooth and less carbonated and less calories but hey ho I just don't get it how anyone can drink any other alcoholic drink apart from cider because they're all absolutely incredibly disgusting anyhow each to their own anyhow the styling is absolutely pathetic on that They've no made any effort whatsoever. Oh, I don't know. Uh, it's maybe not quite as sweet as I thought it would taste, but still, it's not bad. I'd never get it ever again, though, but I'm glad I tried it. Right. I've not got any, any more to say about that uh, liquid-based beverage product. Anyhow, peace. Shout out to one your mother, honey, wins, fair, honey, wins, everyone else, the wins, 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 wins.